forward on this. Good morning, Beth. How are you? Uh, uh, good morning, sir. I'm doing good. Okay. Uh, Beth, when you first saw the ad for the training center in Silang Kabiti, yes, uh, what was your impression? Uh, sir, uh, uh, I'm very happy, sir, because uh, this is one of my prayer uh, to have a training in a BPO job training center, sir. Then I found the Silang Church of Christ BPO job training center, sir. I'm very happy, sir. Okay. Uh, can you list all of the expenses that the school asked you to pay? Uh, sir, uh, I only have an expense, sir, in my payer. But uh, the Silang Church of Christ, uh, we have no expenses, sir. No expenses. So there were yes, no sir. hidden fees, no, nothing, no, nothing no, like sir. that, right? No fees, sir. Okay. Um, tell me what you know about working at a call center. By the way, let me back up and ask that question another way. Yes, sir. Uh, we live and work in the Philippines. And the reality is in the Philippines, how old you are or are not very frequently makes it where you cannot get a job, right? Yes, sir. Is that the case in the BPO industry, to your knowledge? No, sir. In the BPO, sir, there is no age limit, sir. There is no... But in the other company in the Philippines, uh, you have to be only 35 years old, below. Okay. To accept in a job, sir. To be accepted in a job. Okay. Yes, sir. And uh, what else am I going to ask? Give me your review of the training center at Silang Kabiti. Uh, sir, I, I'm very proud to be to have a training in Silang Church of Christ, a BPO job training center, because, sir, uh, I ha I've learned a lot about the call center, sir, and I gain more knowledge and I develop new skill. Okay. Tell me what you think about the people who attend church there at the Silang Church. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, I have a church sir, in Manila, but when I enter a call center here in Silang, uh, I I become a member of the congregation, sir. Now, uh, I am a regular attender in Silang Church of Christ, sir. And I'm very happy, sir, with Sir Ernest and Mam Cora and the rest of the congregation. Now, you said you belong to a church, used to belong to a church in yes, Manila? Sir. Yes. How has your time that you've spent in the Silang at Silang Church? How has that affected your Christian faith? Uh, in Silang Church of Christ, sir, uh, uh, I've learned about uh, more, sir. In uh, about a uh, in Silang Church of Christ, uh, we we study more on Bible, sir. Uh, in my last church, in my last church, sir. Uh, uh, the pastor, sir, uh, sir, I, we, we are not uh, study in more about the Bible, sir. But in Silang Church of Christ, uh, I'm, uh, I've learned about uh, the scripture, sir, the about the Bible. I've learned more, sir. Okay. And is there anything you would like to say to any prospective student that is watching this video and yes. may be considering whether they should go to the orientation day or not? Yes, sir. Uh, I hope the new trainees sir, uh, will more uh, will have more. I hope all the new trainees sir, will have a more uh, knowledge in about the, if they enter the training center. I hope they continue sir up to the OJT, so they will learn more about the call center, sir. Okay. Well, thank you, Beth. I appreciate yes, your sir. time today. Yes, sir. Thank and you so much, sir. Let me stop, let me stop the recording.